So we're here with the LG here, the SID Display Week, and uh, who are you? Uh, my name is Epic Kim from the uh, LG Display. And uh, here you're showing wallpaper OLED. This is super thin. This is the thinnest OLED in the world? Yep. How thin is this? Uh, its thickness is uh, less than 6 millimeter. 6 millimeters, and it's 4K? Uh, this one is uh, Full HD resolution. And the new product, what we will show you, is the ultra definition. Which what is, is this? 77 inches of wallpaper display, which is just released on the market. So this is uh, so thin. What do you mean, released on the market? People can buy uh, this? Just uh, available. When you want to purchase it, it will be waiting for you. So this is just very thin. Uh, is there some other uh, features that are special about this? Uh, there's one connection cable, and it will go to the let's station. Go, let's go around. It, is it possible to see it here? So it goes just one cable through here? Yeah, but it looks like a design. All right. Cool, let's walk around the booth. So you're showing many different display technologies. You have uh, in here, I'm walking in. This is actually doing speaker yep. through. We embedded the speaker inside of the panel, so you can enjoy this system with a sound speaker embedded one. Can we, can we hear this one? Oh yeah. So uh, if there's a saxophonist over there and the piano, it just comes. It can be localized. Yeah. It is it, it, it separate two different ways: stereotype left and right. Uh, so uh, how, how does it work? Is this this inside? Yeah. So how does it work? We call it exciter. Yeah. We call it yeah. exciter, and there are several. Kind of the exciters are located in the uh, middle of the panel, and it vibrates itself. So there's like a few of them yeah. in each corner on the sides a little bit. Yeah. And it can localize the sound. Yeah. On the screen. That means you can use this panel as a speaker. So now you have the 65 inch of the speaker with the panel. Nice. That's really cool. How's the quality compared to normal speakers? If uh, you have big, expensive speakers on the side, it's going to be better than this. Or? Uh, it can replace the current status of the TV system, but uh, I guarantee you will like it. So it's better than normal TV speakers, the thin one people have. Definitely, yeah. yeah. All right, let's walk around. Thanks a lot. All right, let's let's walk over here. Uh, here you have some mobile, mobile and VR. Let me jump in here. So this is a 5.5 inch, ultra we'll 4K. Yep. Yeah. Any phone already have this? Uh, you may hear about the uh, ultra definition, but it's the first time to adopt uh, this size of the bezel with a uh, 4K resolution on smartphone. There's no bezel. There's bezel less. Yep, uh, less than one millimeter. It's like a Mi Mix. Uh, yep. It's a three bezel. Have no, and it's 4K. Yeah, it's and 4K. It's better than the computer's one. But when you do when you do a screen like this, is it fragile, or it will not be fragile? Uh, it's an LCD, so it has some kind of limitation, but as you can see, uh, this quality will give you better performance. And here you have some other uh, mobile display. You have the, the uh, what's called this uh, Cur curved. Curvy smartphone OLED. OLED. But its basement is based on the plastic. So this is plastic, what is it, P OLED? What do you call it? Plastic OLED. Plastic with, OLED. Yeah, with a quad high definition. So very high resolution plastic OLED, that means flexible, no? Uh, or not flexible, it's uh, just it's conformable? Not, uh, yeah, it's a confirmed and the edge is the curved like that way. So, but it's this this plastic, it means it cannot break? Uh, no? I have no idea. In theory, yeah. I mean, that, that, maybe that's the direction? Over here is glass and here is plastic, plastic. Yeah. right? How, how far is in the future maybe this is ready for mass production? Is it's, it ready? Uh, it will be on the market this summer. Whoa, that's cool. So that's that maybe allows many new interesting designs, Application. right? Yeah. It can be new design. Yep. It does it have to be square or you can cut different shapes? Uh, no? Basically, plastic OLED has no limitation of the free foam things. So you can make whatever you want in different ways. We, we have already launched the circle type of the display. And wherever you want, we will be there. How's the quality on plastic OLED compared to glass OLED? What's the quality? Is it as good or is it even better? Or? Uh, the, 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 it looks very, very good. Yeah. So it looks like maybe is at least as good or maybe? Uh, maybe. Basically, plastic OLED, uh, 
is the same uh, quality of the uh, glass OLED, but each the surface delivers better performance. Thinner, uh, right? Yeah. Thinner, stronger, lighter. Yeah. Everything. Better, I mean, it's more immersive. You can be focused on the screen with the plastic. How about reflections? Less reflection. It's up to the consumers. So it can be uh, reflective or just matte screen. Matte screen is possible. Matte is possible here too, or no? Uh, or is more possible with plastic? It's we'll up see. to the market situation. We'll see how yeah. it goes. All right, really looking forward to this. So this is right now is 5.5 inch plastic OLED. This 5.7 inch yep. full HD. Full HD. Hopefully it's not too expensive. And uh, I guess, is the factory completely different to make plastic compared to glass? It's completely different factory or can be the same, can be uh, adapted? Without... Plastic OLED is specialized in certain ways. So as far as you know, we have some specialized uh, factory for a smartphone plastic OLED. It's a new market, it's a new. Yep. Uh, the right one is currently available, but the left one is for the future. How about scratches? Is it more? Is it going to be good enough for scratches, or is it risk that there will be more scratches uh, it's with plastic? Up to the covered glass. Yes. Yeah, so. It's but glass is not plastic. Uh, Cover plastic, maybe, or something. Yep. Yeah. We will see. Oh, okay. I have, an, I have okay. no idea. Sorry, yeah. I asked too much. Yeah. Okay, let's, let's work around some more some more demos right here. Here you have the oh, VR. Sorry. Sorry. sorry, VR is yeah, it's oh, confidential. Okay, okay. Yeah. no, I'll not go in there. And uh, here you have HDR 13.1. Compared to SDR, HDR will deliver better spectrum of the color range. So you can enjoy the HDR on the computer monitor with a 33, a 31 inch of the PC screen. Nice. This is PC monitor, very yep. small bezel, narrow bezel, narrow bezel, and um, thin screen. Nice. You have a curved, 30, curved 38, no. which is the largest size, and the resolution is super wide, quad eye definition. So you sit there and you can really work, and yeah, it will surround you in different ways. All right, 3840. 10 bits. 10 bit? Yeah, which oh. is impeccable. Any other 10 bit display from LG was very Not new. this type of the display. But there's some other 10 bit displays? Yeah, for the small size of the things. And here you have 14 inch 4K. We'll try definition for laptop piece monitor. All right. And what 8K. is this? 8K. Which is one of the best monitor. 31.5. Yep. All right. AK, which is 33 megapixel. It's one of the best display ever ever seen. Nice. So it's not too expensive. People will be able to buy this. Uh, yeah, but uh, you need to uh, prepare some kind of the graphic card for this resolution. Need a fast computer, fast CPU, ARM CPU. In touch system, laptop, 14 and 15 inch of the things. So it means uh, in Ten touch, four. it's better touch. Yep. It feels more immersive. All right, and here you have uh, 23.8. First uh, full HD. Very af maybe affordable or maybe no. Uh, it's under mass production. Right. Over there. Automotive display. Yeah. So is this is this uh, in the car? Is going to be like this? Yeah, automotive display with a better experiment. Whoa. Based on the plastic all that. So there's plastic all, all uh, everywhere? Yeah. Each whole frame is the plastic. Whoa. And you can make free from this by with the plastic all that. That's beautiful. Yep. Deeper black and vibrant colors. And 1920 by 720. Yep. 24 by 9. So that's gonna that's gonna be a very interesting car when this comes out. Yeah, not only for that, we also prepared the transparent all that which is the 60% of the transmittance, 12 inch. Whoa, 60%. Can, yeah. You used to using the HUD, head of display, but now it will change the head of display. 60% is good enough for driving? Uh, it's good enough. Yeah, so you can, uh, you can have amazing uh, HUD. The, the highest quality hard display. Is this ready for mass production? Uh, we are discussing uh, with our customer right. under, under development. And what are you looking at here? Is this Dual radio? display, hybrid one. LCD and OLED transparent display has been collaborated together. So you can use the LCD as a background and the OLED is showing the needle. So is it like 3D effect? Yeah. Or? Yeah. Interesting, cool. Uh, mirror display. 
this is the OLED, it will help you your parking. Parking? Yeah. So is the mirror in the in the car? Yeah, and the low latency will deliver better experience. Whoa. That's Those cool. all things are OLED. Nice. And there is another... The, the very last one is transparent OLED. You've never seen this type of the OLED TV before, but this Whoa. is the larger size than the... So we see the flowers in the back? Yep. Is this full HD? Full HD, 40% of the transparency. Whoa, so what is the use case for this? Is it uh, vending machines? For advertisements, uh, there are lots of the application and it will dominate the world in better design and better experimental things. How does it work, transparent OLED? <laughs> okay, I'm asking too much. Yeah. I'm asking too much, okay, but uh, the, so this is, this looks really interesting. Yeah. The it's current the LCD has the lower transparency, but this one has the better response, uh, better transparency. So you can be immersed by both of the inside and the outside of things. You can see all the three things like that way. So the the shopping window should be like this, right? Definitely. And the the, the vending machine. Imagine that you can, you can use the aquarium inside of the TV. So you can enjoy this one in diversified way. All right. Thanks a lot. Thank you.